Hello, my name is Shatrugan and I work for BMC Remedy Force product. Today I am going to talk about how to use Workbench Developer Tool to test REST APIs provided by BMC Remedy Force. During our demo, we will show you how to log in in Workbench Developer Tool and to test uh, various APIs provided by uh, BMC Remedy Force like creating incident all knowledge article knowledge article details get all service request get service request details etc before we start our demo i would like to uh, uh, tell you about the rest apis what does it stand for so basically rest apis stand for representational state transfer this is a software architectural style and consists of guidelines and best practices for creating a scalable web services. RESTful system typically communicate over the hypertext transfer protocol with the same HTTP verbs like get, post, put, delete, etc. that are used by web browsers to retrieve web pages and send data to remote servers. That the advantages of REST is having a limited numbers of operations for the interaction between the client and services and about api is stand for application programming interface this is a web service that conforms to the architectural principle of rest each api is called by using a standard http request method like post get put or delete more commonly known as crude operations to start our demo we have to first log in in memory force and also in the workbench developer tool so i have already logged in so let's start uh, testing the rest apis provided by bmc so from the above menu go to utilities menu from utilities menu select the rest explorer so this is these are the method used generally used for testing the rest apis so basically in our demo we will uh use or test the apis who's uh, which used uh, which use gate and post method so let's start by from the post method to test the incident apis we have to use the this url and for passing the parameters we need the request body so in the request body we have to use this fields and we need to click on execute so for testing incident apis we have to use this url and we have to pass the parameters like the request body and click on execute after click on execute this will show the error um, the success message that the incident has been created let's check in the console 193 has been created so this shows that uh, uh, we can able to create an incident and workbench developer tools by using the API. Now let's use get method to get the information from remedy force like if you want to uh, use the service request and you want to gather the all the service requests that are created by you in this org then you have to use this URL this is the API's call URL for service request and then click on execute you will see this success matter this it means the retrieval fetching of data are correct and you can see these are the service requests present in the org similarly if you want to test the knowledge article api then you have to use this url for getting all the knowledge articles that are present in this org and then you have to click on execute here it comes the results it shows there are four knowledge articles that are present in this org and created by you Likewise, you can test the other BMC APIs and you have to use the correct URL for that according to uh, the APIs provi provided and we have to use the correct parameters for this. I am sure this video was informative and I would like to thank you for watching this video.